Hey guys, so it's me again. <laughs> I'm back with another video. I know I'm supposed to say all that YouTube stuff, like subscribe, comment. I'm still getting used to this, so yeah, you know, do you boo. <laughs> so I was getting dressed to um, actually go get some food and then you know when you're in the middle of getting dressed and then you just make a mess of your whole room. So as I was getting dressed, I threw half my stuff on my bed and I noticed all these tiny little purses I have. So I was like, why not do a haul? <sighs> Let me get comfortable. Yeah, so I was like, I have all these tiny little bags and yeah, let me just show y'all. <laughs> So the first bag I was looking at was this one. And honestly, um, yeah. So it's the Burberry, now that I know it's a Burberry phone case holder. So when I seen it online, I died, hit my cousin up. You know, she got the connect. She was like, yeah, um, it's really tiny. But, you know, I love it. And I'm like, yeah, it doesn't look that tiny. But, you know, I'm going to get it. Honestly, nothing fits in here except my phone. You could slide a few cards back here, but that's it. You got keys, lip gloss, anything. It has to be in your hand. Nothing but the phone. It really is a phone case holder. So when they said phone case holder, I should have been like, I... Right. Stuffy. When they said phone case holder, I should have said, all right, it really is a phone case holder. No, here I go. Oh, mini purse. Mini purse my butt, but it's cute. Would I buy it again? Probably. For the price, they carried a little, but it's still cute. <laughs> then I have this purse. The Gucci belt bag. This bag is so old. Oh, my lip gloss. Nice. My lip gloss. It's so old. Um, I don't even know where the belt part is. I only know it. I only wear the chain part. Tiny. Like, I mean, this could fit more than a phone. This, I'm not gonna lie. I put my phone. Um, my phone. My keys could probably fit in a card holder I wouldn't say wallet but yeah this fits a little more and it's cute you know you could just throw it on and go but yeah I don't know why I keep well I can't even say I keep buying I don't know why I keep forcing my husband to buy me these tiny little bags and then when I get them I'm just like I can't fit anything in there but I'm wear it. I mean that's what his pockets is for right <laughs> so yes yeah, that's my other teeny weeny bag Moving on, this is just a random bag. I probably got this bag in 2017. It's nothing crazy. I think I bought this bag at like a Forever 21 or something. But when I tell you this is like my favorite bag, oh, it's so cute. And I got it for like $25. So cute. It has been on so many vacations, worn and torn. But I mean, she held up and it's just cute. Like patent leather red is so cute and this could actually fit stuff phone wallet keys all that yeah and you could dress it up you know it just be giving me like a little lipstick vibe <laughs> it's really cute and i mean i wear it like this but the chain it can adjust like to get a full you know only thing i didn't like that was the chain was silver but i mean Sometimes when I wear it, it just look a little off. But it's still cute. Still cute. And sometimes I just like try to adjust it where just the red part is showing so the silver chain is not out. But yeah, cute. 2017 bag. Definitely. I thought I was it. Yep, Forever 21. Alright. Another bag I bought from Forever 21. This little tiny thing. 
So yes, give and bottega, but it's not. It's not. <laughs> it's tiny. I just thought it was so cute. And then I have bought these shoes from Steve Madden. I forgot. Oh, I was going to my friend's wedding. So I bought these shoes. And so I was in Forever 21 first. And then I saw this bag and I was like, oh, that's cute. That's a cute little color. Never picked it up. Didn't pay it no mind. Nothing left. Went to Steve Madden, saw the shoe. And I was like, oh my God, I fell in love with the color, everything about it. Like they had, the, they, at the time they had this shoe in like pink, nude, lavender. This shoe was like very popular at the time. So bought the shoe. Then when I walked out of Steve Madden, it dawned on me like, oh my God, mind you, when I seen this bag, it was just randomly hanging somewhere. So I was like, oh my God, that bag will match the shoe. Ran, like I literally jumped off the escalator, ran downstairs, got back in the store, the bag was still there. So yep, the bag was definitely for me. So I, bought, I wore this bag, this shoe, and a dress. I think the dress was like a little nudie, satin type material. So yeah, they go hand in hand. All right, my next bag, oh, another red one. This one cute from Zara. Um, did Zara carry with the price? Absolutely. I mean, I know what I pay for this bag, $60. I know that's probably like, but for this tiny little, no, I'm lying. I guess $60. I don't know, maybe because, I was thinking about the price on this one. When I be seeing stuff like this, I'll just be like, no. But it's cute. And I bought it. Um, so yeah, what what it had me was the gold chain. And they had a bigger size. I honestly went back for the bigger size. They were sold out. The thing with Zara is once you see it, you gotta get it because sis, it be gone. So um with this bag too, I did see it. Um, and I was like, you know what? The line is too long. When is the long? When is the line never long? I was like, you know what, the line is too long. I'll come back tomorrow went back all of them were gone every single one black this i think they had like a navy blue all of them gone devastated i'm like dang should have just got it should have just stayed on that line probably a week later i'm randomly in the mall let me go check zara again i see just the one sitting then it had like a little sale tag i think it was like 49 don't know what that was about so I was like oh snatched it up and here it is I think honestly <laughs> I don't think I ever wore this bag I don't think I ever wore it. I came home I was going crazy I went to order it online gone everything but yeah it's cute I'm gonna wear it one day probably today I just don't like underarm bag but it's cute it's cute Another like boutique bag. <laughs> so I don't know what this is. I don't know if it's a wallet or a chain. I mean, it's giving Chanel, but it's not Chanel. I got it from a boutique and it's plastic. This bag was forty dollars insane for plastic it's plastic like so again um whenever i have events to go to i always wait till last minute to um buy my outfit so i had to go to my sister's baby shower and um i wanted to wear pastel colors so i had this cute white skirt this like pinky of course she had a girl like this light pink shirt and then my shoes let me show you the shoes. So I wore it with these shoes. Yeah, there's a lot going on. These shoes, man. Again, these shoes are so old, but they a lot, they look crazy. But yeah, so saw so this shoe. Um, I bought these shoes for a hundred dollars. And what is that store? Akira, Akira. You know what I'm talking about, and they sell like the fake stripper clothes and stuff. 
that store um i bought these shoes for a hundred dollars i just don't think boutique clothes should be that expensive you know what i'm saying but anyway but and then the thing about it is these shoes don't even feel like a hundred dollars it's giving maybe 50 because even that when i bought it all these little rhinestones was falling off all over in the baby shower but i get it like you gotta get it how you can yeah whatever and it's not even i don't know i probably i will never probably put these back on again but anyway um bought these shoes then um I had the whole outfit and everything and then again I just happened to be it was like maybe a week before the baby shower happened to be strolling through the mall and then I seen this I think I bought this in that store called edge you know that little boutique that little yo that store is like yeah but anyway yeah I bought it in that store and I'm like y'all yeah, know y'all yeah, ordered this from Alibaba for five dollars and y'all trying to, but again, you get it how you can. But yeah. Then I got. Oh, this is a favorite. <laughs> my Louboutin, my red bottom. She cute. Um, so this bag was given to me for Christmas from Bay. Um. He wanted to buy the big gigantic one so bad. I wanted this one so bad. He was pissed that he had to pay that price for this tiny little bag, but it's what I wanted. Um, so it's, it gets real tricky with this bag. I don't know, people be like black go everything. I don't think so. I'm sorry, my opinion, I don't think black goes with everything. So with this bag, I honestly feel like I could only wear it with red bottoms or like a full black sandal because um, the red is tricky. Like if I'm saying, all right, this is a black bag, it goes with everything. I put on like some green sandals, it looks off because now I look like I got on. You know what I'm saying? So this bag only goes with all black shoes or like honestly, I think red bottoms. And this fits quite a few stuff. I mean, if you're not going, be, if you just going out for a little bit, and you know, you could definitely throw your phone. What's that phone? Throw your phone in there. Um, my wallet does fit in there, and a lip gloss, maybe a little, a little makeup refresher palette thingy. But yeah, it's cute. This is one of my favorites, honestly. So this, this bag, um, I was going to get married and we had an all white event the day after the wedding. And I had all white and then, let me show you the shoes. I have bought these gold shoes from Fashion Nova. Yeah, so they like wrap around your whole thigh, like it came all the way up. It was cute, it was real cute. So I bought those and then, I was on this um, website looking for earrings, then I seen this. And I was like, oh, that would look so nice with the shoes, the dress, everything. So when I seen the price, I was like, why? I mean, I bought it anyway, but y'all know how much this bag was? This bag was almost $150, $150 if you include um, shipping and handling and all that so i seen it on this little um yeah this airing website and then they had like little bags like these and all their bags was like a hundred and up but i seen the bag i love it so much and i swiped and now we're here and now i think i will probably never wear it again but i mean who knows i'll probably wear something I don't know, gold, pearly, whatever. I mean, nothing really fits in this bag, like nothing. Um, my phone don't fit in it, nothing. Like, maybe keys. But it's so cute. <laughs> it's cute. So I have this bag and I don't feel like it's that small. I feel like it's a decent, it's a decent size. Um, I could fit stuff in here, you know. 
let's not let's take this out of the equation let's not call that teeny weeny i love this bag so much i want to wear it everywhere everywhere i just wish i could put stuff in it so um yeah that doesn't fit in there maybe this oh this look goes beat up maybe this will fit in there um keys definitely don't fit because my keys i have my car keys and my house keys together it's a big bunch don't fit um yeah maybe just a lip gloss maybe not maybe just lip gloss so this your phone goes in your hand and you just better not carry anything else because I mean you could fit your card holder or that's it but for price the price my husband paid for this I was like man I mean that's expensive but again it's so cute I mean you can't go wrong with this bag that I feel like the, I I said black don't go with everything I kind of feel like this bag go with a lot of stuff like when I throw it on with anything, it just always looks good. So, yeah, this is definitely a keeper. Do I regret asking for this? Nah, it's cute. I want the big one though. This one is cute though. <laughs> oh, one of my favorites. My Fendi bucket. So this bag, um, I like I wish I could wear it everywhere I mean for the most part I wear a lot of browns and nudes I just started switching my um, wardrobe up to you know nudie colors and stuff I just feel like it just looks nicer like I'm not into um like hot pinks and neons and all that I'm really not into those things so um yeah I could wear this bag a lot and that's why I could wear this bag a lot because I have those, you know, nudes and browns. But yeah, this bag is definitely one of my favorites. Um, I could I could fit everything in here, everything I need. My phone could go in here, my, oh, my wallet. One of my wallets is already in there. My wallet could go in here, my phone, my keys, everything. Like, and I could pack it up and still be okay. And I just think it's so little, like, <laughs> it's just cute. I love this bag. Um, my favorite? I don't know. It's between. I don't know. Depends on the occasion. The occasion, but this is definitely up there. Definitely top five. Um, and then I got this that I probably abused. Like, I would say the last two, three years. This bag has never stayed in Atlanta. Anytime I've been to Jamaica, even when I was living in New York, did I have this bag when I? Nope. I bought this bag when I moved down here. Yeah, this bag has been on my past couple of vacations. Um, this is my home girl right here. I love this bag, and I know y'all gonna be like, "Oh, it looks crazy." I've gotten so many compliments on this bag. Like, it's so cute. It's a little, yeah, it's a hard. I mean, it's clear, so you know, you can't put just anything in there. My phone cannot fit in it at all. But I mean, I guess my phone goes in my hand at this point when I wear any of these bags. I just throw my lip gloss, my keys, my, you know, whatever in there. And sometimes I do put my, su my stuff in like a little sack and then put it in here because it just makes the bag look cuter than to just have stuff thrown all over the place inside of it. But yeah, and this bag was from Forever 21 and it was like, so it was like $40 and then you know how fashion always be having those things or everything go on sale and it'd be like a hundred percent off <laughs> like i cut this back for 25 dollars yes so and then the crazy part about it is i originally had made an order made an order with forever 21 and I, I had this bag in it and at the time i had paid the 40 dollars and someone stole my package 
yes i i bought a whole bunch of stuff um a couple blouses um i think a pair of sandals and this bag they stole the package and i was devastated i didn't even care about the other stuff i just wanted this and i was like man like i was so sad and i went back i was just like you know i'm just ordering it again went on and i don't know why i didn't order it I think I was, I was, oh, I was busy doing something. And you know, you just fill up the car and then you'd be like, all right, I'll come check out later. When I was going to check out, that's when I seen it was for 25. I was like, mm. oh, last but not least, I mean, you know, the common, the regular, the everyday, regular, regular, schmegler. This one, the Prada. The Prada crossbody. So I say this bag. Um, I could fit everything in this bag. I love this bag. Um, it's nice for traveling. I don't know. They say dress it up or dress it down. I don't think it's a dressy bag. I think this bag is only cute when I'm like, when I'm sporty, when I have like workout clothes on, or you know, like maybe a pair of jeans or something. But which I barely, I don't know when's the last time I wore jeans, but yeah, I think it's only cute with like leggings and those type of things. Um, a dressy event? No, absolutely not. Cause you know, the, the, the nylon and no, but I mean, yeah, you could throw everything in there and just go. Yep. And then you have this cute little pouch thingy up here. I have never probably unzipped this thing ever in my life. Um, I guess this is for, I can't even say coins because nobody carries those no more. Maybe your money, but your money would be in your wallet. Your cards will also be in your wallet. So I don't know. I don't use it, but yeah, this is definitely, a, um, this is a good buy. Good purchase. Good, good, good stuff. Yeah, y'all. So that's all my stuff. Um, I think I was just bored and I was like, let me show them my bag. So they go my teeny weeny bags <laughs> if you like this video comment subscribe share with a friend tell a friend to tell a friend all right let me go get dressed i'm out <laughs>